when we understand God, um, from a Christian perspective, is like you said, um, Father, Son, Holy Spirit, yeah. separate in person, but um, but uh, the same or one in being or essence, right? That's how we. Again, I'm not asking you to agree with it. I'm just giving you what. Actually, I, I, I'll, I'll bring that point up later, but carry on. Finish your explanation about the separation. That's the main thing. Okay, right. So there was a separate. There was a sep there was a separation at a point in time between. Um, Jesus and Yahweh when he cried out, my God, my God, why are you forsaken? So when you say separation... Okay, well, let me finish my yeah, point, please. At that point, he took on the sins of the world. So it wasn't that Jesus sinned as to why he separated from God. Was he God, separated God, from God? Yeah, yeah, I already said that, yeah. When, uh, when he took on the sins of the world. How can he be separated from God if he was God? Be because they're, they're not, they're one in being, not one in person. I know they're not one in person. Yeah. Did the person get separated from God? No, no, no. So we're saying that, so if you go back to John 1, 1. What separated? That's what I'm asking. What separated? I said the sins of the world. Jesus took on the sins of the no, no. world. Jesus said, my God, my God, why have you abandoned me? Yeah, yeah, So yeah. who abandoned whom? Say again? Who abandoned whom? God separated from, or the Father, Yahweh, separated from Jesus. The at son. a point in time. Yeah, the son. Okay, so the father... The, okay, sorry, the, like, the like, son separated okay, so from the point. point. Yeah, go on. Yeah, yeah so... I'm trying yeah, to understand your yeah, point. Yeah, so, yeah, so... But if I can continue, yeah, then sure, you can on. hear what I'm saying. So, when Jesus cried out on the cross, my, fa um, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? At that point in time, there was a split between Yahweh and Jesus. If you wow. go back to John 1, 1, in the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. And then if you fast forward to verse 14, it said, then the God... Uh, sorry, and the Word became a human being which we believe to be Jesus Christ. Now, when Jesus cried that out at, on the cross, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? At that point in time, he was separated from, he was separated from the Father. Who was separated? Jesus was separated from the was Father. Was it the Son, the second person of the Trinity? Say again? Was the second yeah, person? Yeah, Jesus is the Son of God, the second person of the Trinity. So yes. did the second person of the Trinity separate from? The Father, yes. The Father, the first person of the yes. Trinity. Yes. Okay, does that mean the in Trinity broke at that point? Arguably, it depends which way you want to theologically argue it. That's it. If the Trinity breaks, your God broke. Yeah, but then, but yeah, but if you if you keep going, if you keep reading, then it says that your, uh, Yahweh, the Bro, Father. Bro, are you listening to yourself? I know what you're trying to Can say. Can God break? But no, because God is God. He can't break. But you, they separated. That means they broke. Yeah, in his humanity, in in his in his humanity, not in his divinity. You said the second person of the Trinity. Yeah, Jesus is the second person. So of the did Trinity. the second person of the Trinity separate from Jesus, the first once again? What I'm saying is, in is fact, that Jesus agree. Jesus has two natures: one being human, one being divine. So yeah, Jesus, don't separate them. Yeah, because Muslims will say that how can God die? For no, no, example? Christians should not separate them unless you're a heretic, Let's, and they should not separate the two. So the second person of the Trinity. When I say the second person of the Trinity, yeah. it includes both. But with both, both what? Sorry, say it, clarify, please. The the divine and the human. Yeah, in one in one person. Yeah, so it's still one Christ. person. That one person, which is the second person of the Trinity, yeah. separated yeah. from the first person of the Trinity. Yeah. Which means the Trinity, whatever it was, is yeah. no longer the Trinity.